Hello everyone, with you auto problems, crossovers in our country are very popular lately. It is not surprising, since these cars combine the qualities of city cars and SUVs. But not all Russians can afford an expensive car. Therefore, we present you with a rating of the best budget crossovers. It includes only those models that in 2021 can be purchased new in car dealerships in our country. Lot X-Ray Cross Those who are looking for an expensive new reliable crossover should definitely pay attention to this car of a well-known Russian manufacturer. It is quite durable and has good driving characteristics. The car has good cross-country ability, despite the lack of all-wheel drive configurations. After all, its ground clearance is as much as 215 mm, and the suspension is quite strong. Therefore, the car can be safely operated on minor impassibility. In addition, it rides quite well on the highway and has a lot of modern electronic assistance and safety options, especially in top versions. And in the city, parking on this car is very easy even in a limited space, since it has a very compact size. The crossover is produced only with gasoline engines of 1.6 liters, power, 106 and 113 horsepower, and 1.8 liters, 122 horsepower. The last motor is not considered reliable. There may be oil leaks and some other problems. Therefore, for trouble-free operation, it is better to choose specimens with a 1.6-liter power unit, especially since it is practically impossible to lose anything in dynamics, and the fuel consumption of this car is very low. Also, you should not take a complete set with a variator, since this unit is almost never famous for its durability. But even with a manual transmission, driving this car is easy and pleasant and its main disadvantages are a small trunk and interior. Therefore, the car is hardly suitable for transporting goods and long trips. Lada Vesta SW Cross The Russian station wagon with increased ground clearance also entered the top 10 affordable crossovers in 2021. A car worth less than $1 million has a lot of options that are usually found in more expensive cars. It is safe and reliable. And the interior of the car cannot be called uncomfortable. It is spacious and comfortable. There are versions with climate control and a modern multimedia system, as well as other nice options. And electronic assistants are responsible for confidence on the road. This crossover can be bought with engines of 1.6 or 1.8 liters. But it is undesirable to choose the latter, since there are many complaints about it. The car can have a power of 106, 113 or 122 horsepower. With. It is quite agile and dynamic. There are complete sets with a simple and reliable manual transmission and a variator. But a continuously variable transmission should not be chosen by those who are not ready for rather expensive maintenance and possible early repairs on low mileage, especially if used incorrectly. Despite the lack of all-wheel drive, the ground clearance of 203mm easily allows this car to cope with bad roads. Therefore, it is suitable not only for the city and the highway, but also for field trips. A spacious interior and trunk will make it a great option for traveling. Moreover, the car is easy to drive, and fuel consumption is low. Renault Arcana Thinking about which new crossover to choose with a limited budget, you should pay attention to this stylish young Frenchman with good speed and dynamic performance. Medium-sized car ideal for city and highway. And thanks to the presence of all-wheel drive configurations, field trips are also possible. True, you should not load it with bad roads, since the suspension is rather weak for this. The crossover is equipped with petrol engines of 1.3 or 1.6 liters with a capacity of 114 or 150 horsepower. The motors are quite reliable, but many drivers complain about increased fuel consumption. There are versions with mechanical transmission and CVT. A continuously variable transmission is considered short-lived. Therefore, such options should not be taken by those who are afraid of expensive repairs. The car is very comfortable and endowed with many modern security systems but its electrical equipment is subject to minor breakdowns. It is also believed that the interior and trunk are a little cramped. You can buy a new car within 1.5 million rubles or a little more. Nissan Toronto Inexpensive crossover of a famous brand from Japan. It is famous for its reliability and maneuverability. The car is equipped with gasoline power plants, the maximum power of which is 143 horses. There are versions with manual or automatic transmission. There are also all-wheel drive options that are good even for significant off-road. Since the car's ground clearance is 205 mm, we can safely talk about good cross-country ability. But it's also great for city and highway driving. True, it is better not to use it for travel, since the capacity is small. The Japanese are famous for their reliability and unpretentiousness. It has economical fuel consumption and is endowed with a minimum package of safety and comfort options. But there is no need to talk about chic equipment. 
but adaptation to Russian conditions is excellent. And the cost of the car will not exceed 2 million rubles. In the minimum trim levels, you can buy it much cheaper. Renault Capture Inexpensive compact crossover with a stylish youth design. It is easily recognizable in traffic, dynamic and agile. The car is sold with two options for gasoline engines, the power of which is 114 or 150 horsepower. They are quite reliable and economical. There are versions with manual transmission and CVT. The latter is considered short-lived. It requires expensive maintenance and strict adherence to all operating rules. The car is considered very passable, because it has all-wheel drive equipment and a ground clearance of as much as 204 mm. But experts don't recommend driving too hard on bad roads, as this Frenchman's suspension isn't designed for that. In addition, some cars have problems with electrical equipment. Sometimes owners complain about cheap interior trim and poor build quality. But at the same time, the car is quite safe and has many modern security systems and electronic assistance. And you can buy a car for about 1,200,000 to 1,500,000 rubles. Hyundai Creta, perhaps the most famous of the inexpensive crossovers throughout our country. It has been popular with us for many years due to its low cost, excellent quality, cross-country ability, efficiency and equipment. At the same time, the car has an attractive appearance and small dimensions, ideal for the city. The Korean is produced with gasoline power plants with a volume of 1.6 or 2 liters. Their power ranges from 123 to 150 horsepower. Motors are reliable and unpretentious. You can buy a car with both mechanics and automatic. There are front and all-wheel drive configurations. Four-wheel drive, combined with a considerable ground clearance of 190 mm, provides good cross-country ability on insignificant off-road conditions. The crossover is equipped with many modern security systems and electronic assistance. They are found even in the cheapest trim levels. And expensive versions are in no way inferior to higher class cars in terms of equipment. The car is perfectly adapted for Russia, but its suspension does not always withstand bad roads. Also. Many drivers complain about poor sound insulation and poor quality interior trim. But these shortcomings are completely removable if desired. Especially since the car is cheap. It can now be bought for 1,200,000 to 1,500,000 rubles. Renault Duster For several years in a row, the top of the most reliable and affordable new crossovers cannot do without this car of a popular French brand and domestic assembly. This car is unpretentious and reliable. It has excellent cross-country ability, especially in all-wheel drive trim levels. In addition, the Frenchman has an impressive ground clearance of 210 mm. It is sold with petrol and diesel power plants. The power of gasoline engines is 114 or 143 horsepower. With, and diesel, 110 horses. Now the car can be bought both with a manual transmission and with a variator. But the latter option is undesirable for those who are afraid of frequent and expensive repairs especially on short runs. The crossover cannot boast of a luxurious interior and rich equipment. But it has everything you need to ensure safety and confidence on the roads. The car is very roomy, and therefore ideal for transporting goods or traveling with a large company. Its disadvantages include poor sound insulation and cheap interior trim materials. But these disadvantages are insignificant and can be easily corrected if desired. Currently, you can buy a car no more than 1,500,000 rubles. But there are plenty of cheaper kits out there. Cherry to go for. When you have to choose an inexpensive crossover with good equipment, you can pay attention to this Chinese. In the maximum configuration, it now costs about 1,300,000 rubles. At the same time, for such money you can get almost a luxury car. But at the same time it is intended only for the city and the highway. Even minor off-road conditions are undesirable for the Chinese, since his ground clearance is low and there is no all-wheel drive. In addition, there is a risk of damage to the already not the most reliable suspension elements. But for urban conditions, the car is almost ideal, as it has small dimensions and low fuel consumption. In addition, there are configurations with a CVT, which is very convenient in traffic jams. True, a continuously variable transmission does not differ in durability. Therefore, even at a relatively low mileage, expensive repairs or replacements may be required. To avoid this, it is recommended to choose versions with manual transmission. The crossover is produced only with gasoline engines, among which there are very powerful ones. The maximum power of this car is 147 horses. It is believed that the motors are quite reliable. The car is equipped with many security systems and electronic assistance. He's pretty comfortable. Salon trimmed with fairly solid materials. And the main disadvantage of the car is considered, 
in addition to the possible poor quality assembly, a very small trunk. Therefore, the car is unsuitable for the transport of goods. FAW Bester Next 40. When choosing a cheap new crossover, you can pay attention to this Chinese if you have 1,100,000 to 1,200,000 rubles in your pocket. This car will certainly appeal to those who need an attractive and expensive appearance, as well as rich equipment, but driving performance is not so important. After all, the car is equipped with a relatively weak gasoline engine. Its capacity is only 108 mares, and the volume is 1.6 liters. This motor should not be considered particularly reliable. At the same time, there can be no question of any cross-country ability, since the car is produced only with front-wheel drive. It is not famous for its high ground clearance and reliable suspension, and therefore it is better to operate it only on the highway and in the city. By the way, there are configurations not only with manual transmission, but also with automatic transmission, which are so convenient in city traffic jams. The car is equipped with many security systems, electronic assistance and comfort options. But at the same time, they should not be considered too reliable. According to the owners, the car is characterized by frequent minor breakdowns of electrical equipment and more. Lifon X60 If you do not think too much about reliability and increased comfort or stylish design, then you can safely purchase this inexpensive Chinese-made crossover. It is unlikely to please its owners with the absence of breakdowns, even minor ones, but they will like it with very rich equipment. At the same time, you can buy this car very cheaply. Its maximum configuration now costs a little more than a million rubles. For that kind of money, you can get a luxury car in terms of equipment. The car is sold with not the most dynamic engine with a capacity of 128 horsepower and a volume of 1.8 liters. There are conflicting rumors about its reliability. But the fact that you should not take this crossover with a variator is clear. After all, this unit is not designed for long-term operation, and therefore it is worth considering only options with a manual transmission. The car is equipped with multiple electronic systems, but at the same time they are not always reliable and configured correctly. In addition, the quality of sound insulation is not encouraging. But the trunk and interior are very roomy. It is also worth noting the low quality of the paintwork, on which chips and scratches form very quickly. Therefore, this car is very controversial. And it suits those who need a roomy and spacious crossover with modern equipment, but, most likely, for a short time. It will be very interesting to know your opinion about the list. And that's all for me. Thank you all for your attention, I will be very grateful if you subscribe to the channel, see you soon.